Waterloo Sarah. Or Alberta Peretti. Or Ralph Lauren. Or Vivian Westwood. Screw them if they're wearing the same outfit. Powder Blue Gucci. They should be concentrating on their acting, not on their clothes. In Tinseltown, it's not just about the movies, it's about image. $3,000 is nothing to Vegas businessman Fabrizio Bacardi. The image of Italian man, in my opinion, in America, you know, the women think they're all uh, playboys. So uh, it's a tough image that I have to fight with. Self-styled as the king of Vegas, Fabrizio is planning a takeover of one of the largest casinos in town. Do you need anything for the Beverly Hills Hotel or Spago? A lot of things can be achieved in life. And uh, all you have to do is to dare to do it. you got to do it. You know, I, I don't take uh, no for an answer. Each weekend, he flies to L.A. on his private jet to party, but there's always business on his mind. Welcome to L.A., right? Welcome to LA. I'm very passionate about what I do, and that's, I live for my dream, to dream to dare to win. I don't like the challenge. I love the challenge. I love it. After jetting in, it's straight to his exclusive bungalow at the Beverly Hills Hotel for some relaxation. And Fabrizio wants to be prepared. He's looking for a base in L.A. and is house hunting with his publicist, Eileen Koch. <laughs> oh, my God. Well, I don't look really no, wait a moment. Do I look very bad, Helen? No, wait a Without moment. Without makeup? Without... How can I be? I mean, I look terrible. <laughs> this is terrible, guys. Yeah, I don't look... I can't I believe it. And real estate agent to the stars, Elaine Young, has found the perfect property for Fabrizio in the Hollywood Hills. Yeah, it's three levels. Every level is more beautiful than the next. It's something very unique, a marble fireplace that's floor to ceiling, which is very unusual. Yeah. Uh, Tell me how much they want. They're Please. asking four and a half million. We just listed it. They'll take yeah. less. Four and a half, yeah. Mm -hmm. Four and a half yeah. million for sale. I like and that. Wow. Believe it or not, I leased Elvis Presley all his houses until about the 20th year he bought. Elvis, did I look, do I look like Elvis? Uh, you're cuter than Elvis Presley. Oh, thank you. And I knew him really well. And God he was your you. age when I met him, too. God and you're you. still cuter. God bless you. God bless you. Wow. <laughs> you know, I think it's a good, uh, it's a good house. I, it's certainly more my style because it's big. It's right. Either I'm going to rent it for a couple of years or maybe we make them an offer to buy it. In the meantime, Fabrizio is planning a night out with models Ryan and Monica. He's just a really good businessman, and he's young and good looking. I heard he was a playboy. <laughs> That's what I heard. <laughs> Straight up. I'm young, ambitious, focused, and I have the ability to make history, and I will. His playboy image doesn't worry me, no. I can handle it, no problem. I want to be the next king of Vegas, and I will be the next king of Vegas. I don't I'm not a playboy, first. I'm not a playboy. Back in Beverly Hills, Fabrizio is enjoying his evening at exclusive celebrity hangout, Spargo's. <laughs> Girls, if we were alone, I would lock the doors. <laughs> And at Trendy Club Barfly, Fabrizio doesn't even have to be on the guest list to go straight in. Thank you so much. I love you all of you. I love you, I love you, I love you. I want to see you again now. Please come with me. I love LA. I shall be back next weekend. Oh, we got to take off, man. <laughs>